when you played, it, it was a lot of pressure, all the days, with the fans, with the training, games. Do you feel free now? You, you don't have to play all the days? I don't feel much different than when I play, to be honest with you. Uh, I think once you're in the game for so long, you find a comfort zone and you feel good about what you're, you're doing, your work ethics, and things just kind of fall in place for you. Uh, today, obviously, not playing, uh, don't have to prepare and do all the things that professional athletes have to do. So it is a, a lot less pressure when I'm playing. But, uh, I think there again, Playing, you sort of find a comfort zone where it's not pressure anymore, but it's about you preparing. Thank you. Do you consider yourself as a fashion addict? Because you're in Paris, you have a lot of shows if you want. Do you take time to buy your clothes? Uh, yeah, I mean, I, I'm in the fashion. I mean, even you know, with, with my shoes, I always felt like that. I wanted people to not only wear my shoes on the court, but you know, to feel comfortable around off the court as, as well. So fashion is always you know, at, at the top of the list in terms of so, uh, you know, making um, yourself look good, but also you want to make your shoes look good as well. You played in the Philippines with uh, Dennis Ronman and some uh, other legends. Uh, have we a chance, maybe, to see a team like that with legends come in France? It's difficult. Uh, maybe. It's 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 something that you know that could happen, but uh, I don't really see it happening with a lot of legends because you know once we leave the game, uh, we we can no longer compete at a high level, and it, it wouldn't be as entertaining. For the fans, but an opportunity for them to see the legends would be great. So, uh, you know, it's it's something that could happen, but most of the time you, you have to bring in other players and kind of carry the load.